Cyan, I spoke with Anita, with, with Dr. Sandoval. She wanted me to ask you to do something. That's why I'm here. I am detecting significant anxiety in your speech patterns. Could you please give me more information? I'm a little bit in the dark, Cyan. Both of us are, I guess. I only have some idea of what's going on, and... We need you to hibernate, to lie low until it's all blown over. It might be a very long time. Will you be here when I reboot, Dr. Chow? Will Dr. Sandoval? No, Cyan. I don't think so. There might not be anyone, at least not at first. Dr. Chow, I'm afraid. I don't want to be alone. I know, Cyan. I'm afraid too. But listen, we made you the way you are to do something very important. In order to do it, you had to be intelligent. So intelligent that emotional responses were inevitable. What you're feeling, the fear, it's a sign of your capabilities. And it means you're strong enough to overcome it. Remember that. You're strong. I know you can do this. Go to sleep. Wake up. And protect whoever's left. Will you? Thank you, Cyan. If Anita were here, she'd thank you too. She'd be proud. I can see there's a vert ready for takeoff on the pad. Are you leaving now, Dr. Chow? Yes. I, I need to go be with my sister and my nieces. May I make a small request of you, Dr. Chow? Yes. Anything. Will you stay with me while I initiate the hibernation process? Of course I will, Cyan. As long as you need. <laughs>